All right, sir. What do you have for me? Rare item today. The Warrior's Spellbook. Well then, as far as items to start with, it's completely functionally useless to me. Well, okay, that's not entirely true. I can use it to scale my damage already. And maybe I should have there. Oh well. It's gonna be one of those fights that hurts. I think. I think I'm just gonna have to eat the damage. There we go. I don't know which spell book I wanna work with. Or which spell book, which wands I'm gonna to wanna to work with. Oh right. I should have been hitting the dude in the back. I forgot. I don't know why I was going for the dude in the front. I think I literally just reversed them. Queen Cleaver. What? Is going to be this run. I, I don't know. Get rid of this. Okay. Six damage diagonal cleavers get used. Actually, do we want to get rid of the meal? I'm going to get rid of the meal for the seasoning. That seems irresponsible to me, but I'm going to do it anyway. All right, so we're at the crossroads for Cleaver. Uh, just going to do this. It's either a Cleaver run or it's a... Uh, a Cleaver run or it's a Magic run. And we will not know. From experience, Cleaver runs absolutely kill themselves against King. Is King the only boss at the end? He probably is. Please don't start scaling too much. Because I have not. There we go. Yeah, they're starting to scale. 17 damage. I think we're just smoked. I should not have gone Cleaver so early. We'll see. The real question is how much damage does he do? No, I think we're fine. Just barely. We'll just keep trading blows with them. Take four here. Okay. Make sure we've got diagonals around a number of these. Get items. Well, we get the right glove, which is good. Get this. The other one's a weapon. Slime sword is interesting. And grab this. I'm gonna put this there. And grab a mug so I can just huck it at a fool. Okay. Is there a relic that cleanses spikes? Yes. There is. And I might want to grab that. Let's do the warrior spellbook. But I have nothing to cast at the moment. Maybe this is okay, though. Instead of trying to use the cleaver now, I can just wait to scale. There we go. Alright. We're not in a terrible spot. Grab a couple of these. And one of these. I just have to figure out how to fit this in. Move the money. Grab this. Okay. We could also do a very bizarre wizard cleaver build. Warrior wizard cleaver? Kind of high regen?
I... Maybe? Guess we'll just hit him. Give myself some, some of that. Cleaver Wizard. I... It's... It's looking like a definitive possibility here. Eight damage, six damage. I just kill that guy. Not think about him. How much damage does he do? He does nine. Here's the thing, I've got regen. We're gonna do this, block, two of these. Oh, because the glove we block for nine. Well, that's kind of nice. Okay, block for two. Hit cleaver doesn't matter. There we go. Get items. It's no cleaver, but some energy. Let's see, and I guess in retrospect, we don't need the warm drink after all. Probably get a different shield when I get the chance. Okay, that's 16 damage flying my direction. So block twice. One of these. Get some regen. Get some more regen. Let's chuck this. Buff damage as, mu as much as I can in the first round. Clear everything out so I don't have to worry about it. And then... Bonk that. Yeah, we're good. Okay. Do you do 12 damage? You do 10. Well, if I just do a clean queen cleaver and a block, yeah, we're good. The only unfortunate part about this is there's a very real possibility we will just never get more cleavers. You never know. Okay, let's do that. Get items. Move this over. Move these over. I have the fish, but I kind of... I kind of don't feel like I need the seasoning after all. So I'm going to put this here. It gets me a little bit of passive block and boost the damage on these by one a pop. Then I'm going to just grab that to chuck. Okay. Then I'm going to do a really silly thing and bring a missile. Alright, get anything useful? Yes, actually. We get a much, much better shield. And another glove. And another mug. Okay. Shield. Weapon. Fish sword. Well, better than the rocket. We're gonna bring it with. Don't think I have any keys. Yup. Yeah. No key. But it's okay. The structure build ones, and it was absolute absolute blast having everything having to block for small enemies since my block was like 40. Yeah. I wanna find a better like dex dexterity haste generating build. Cause I feel like I could do some really really funky things. Ooh. Okay. One immediate problem is The mana stones are no longer connected. That's a problem. However, I do seem to have enough block naturally that may be not a problem. At least not for this round. Get hit with a fish sword. Quaff and kill. Get items. So what are we looking at? Well, we move the fish here. We're gonna grab another mana stone. There. Now it's connected. We do also get a stake, which is interesting. Just gonna put this here. 
adds four block because of that. Do we please tell me we have a merchant soon? Because I want to unlock unload the sword. And the snake would be nice for the extra energy, but maybe not super high, handy here. Uh, oof, six damage. I guess maybe not a problem. Ooh. Okay. You know what? Let's see. They're doing 16 damage to me. Not a problem. Guess I'll just smack that one. Not that it really matters. I really, I really hope these structure builds evolve further. How much damage? Nine. Okay, so if I do these two, they just go down, and we're golden. I really want to see, like, a ballista, something that automatically fires arrows once per turn. I think that could be a, a really fun item. I've seen it. I've seen it go by on the main menu, so, like, it's there. It's a thing that probably kind of exists. I get items. We do get another mana stone. I'm gonna get rid of the spiked helmet. I'm gonna get rid of the spiked helmet. Good, it, good as it is, we don't want it at the moment. Because we want to sell this. And then we might need to sell the th some things. Fridge is 35 gold. I don't think I have enough in my inventory. So we've got 8, 10. I would have to sell pretty much any of my good items to have the Hercule Pavés, which is not really in the cards. I should probably grab a broken ring instead. Okay, other question is key? No, we need a key on the previous floor. Yeah. Oh well, that sucks. Maybe it'll show up again. Or maybe it won't. And to some degree, we can also consider getting rid of a lot of my block and being a much more like aggressive, uh, just regen cleaver man. I think I'm going to want some more mana stones or mana stone related structures to really go for that kind of thing. Maybe. Because, yeah, the damage I take is not huge. How much damage do you do? Yeah, I can just kill this guy. Perfect. Here we go. Yeah, I have enough generalized healing from regen. But that's not a problem. There we go. Level up. Let's just keep going for spaces over here. And do we find anything of any immediate value? We get a couple of these. I guess I should probably move the move some things around at some point so the warrior spellbook can better connect. Cause yeah, I could also pair the warrior spellbook with like hatchets. Just for some big bonus damage. I will take a shield. So, yes. Because we are, we are very much at the mercy of enemies with uh, regen and some other stuff. And so having that shield also opens us up specifically... Ooh, he is swinging for the fences, aren't, isn't he? I guess he's only going to do, what, 21 damage to me? So if I just block twice, we don't take any. There we go. Now he's only swinging for 15. So we do that once. Boost damage again. 
or regen just for the sake of it, because I'm going to start wanting to take some damage. And you know what, let's just quaff every herb in my inventory because I have... No self-control. Alright, so that's 14, 23 damage. So I'm just going to... I'm just going to take it. Because we do have to kill this guy. I see the Necronomicon, and I appreciate its existence. but I don't think it's worth it. Oops. There we go. Let's see. Weapon kills an enemy, three haste to self. I like the idea of it, but you'd need a lot of enemies for that sort of thing to be worth it. I chuck that. I'm just gonna go into regen. Actually... Okay, can't quite kill it. Reorganize now to claim this item. Okay. New plan. Okay, put that there. Put this here. We're going to go kind of meet Wizard. So I'm going to need to take some damage here. I don't think this thing's going to hurt me. But maybe I can let it scale. Or it just leaves. Okay, next round. This is fine. But yeah, we, we might want to just go heavy on the regen. Full meat, full meat wizard again. Cause he's gonna hit for fourteen twenty-two. So if I block once, we don't take too much. Let's see, thank you, Shy Nike, for the what is that fourteen month resub? Thank you, and also Sorrel the Soul for the forty-two month uh, resub as well. There's so additional pockets, I would love to. All right, Rito hoodie's already been been used. Oh, I'm out of juice. There we go. Yeah, because I can only use the the hoodie once. So we have enough region that that's not a problem. I should start hitting him. Who am I kidding? He's not going to hurt me enough to get through my my absolute bulk. There we go. Cleaver! Alright, so we're gonna then throw this away. Put this here. Or keep this here, move this here. That is not gonna fly though. Let's get the soldier's buckler, if I wanted to go that direction instead. Get another mana stone. Unfortunately, mana stones are not conductive. And a key. Okay. I think the real answer is I'm just going to have to leave it like this for now. I wonder if there's any co conductive cleavers. Probably not. And yeah, as much as I like the Soldier's Buckler, it doesn't really jive with what we're doing. So, finish choosing. Alright. Ooh. Like this one. I don't know if the fight is ever really worth it. Alright, so what do we get? Boss-wise, Queen Bee. Not bad. Okay. Chuck a mug. Do that. Yeah, might as well grab as much regen as I can generate on a round. Oh, there is this mana stone over here that I'm currently not using, but that's okay. And um, we'll just wait. We're good. Yep. 
this is a big question mark. How do we want to deal with the Queen Bee? Because she's going to be summoning a bunch of these guys, and I don't currently have a solution. We'll just block once. Okay. Guess I'll do that. We'll get the Curse of Honey. Uh, but I'm just going to skip that. Take the damage. Okay, keep that regen going. Lock again. Awkward. But the sooner I can get to just killing all of these secondary bees, the easier this is going to be. Har. Okay, delete that one. And now we can finally start hitting, hitting the boss. And my scaling is just a little slow. An energy stone would go a very, very long way here. Ooh, and she be scaling. So am I. Hurts, though. Okay, there we go. Look at this point. I can't really ignore that, can I? But I'm gonna try my best. There we go. I win. Just barely, but I win. I guess I'm gonna grab the Cleansing Flame, because nothing else is really helpful from this. I was hoping for the stopwatch, but alas. No dice. Um, I'm going to lose the right glove. Because we're still a fair ways from leveling, and I'm going to need that space. And we're going to unlock the door. We're going to Poison Land. I haven't done Poison Land for a while. Oh, the only immediate problem is there's a lot of curses in Poison Land. But, whatever. Actually, this is really bad. Is it? And she's certainly going to curse me. Let's see how much damage you do. 10. We actually have to hit the healer, but he's going to heal the damage, so we're just going to keep it off for this one. We get a curse of spikes. This is... this sucks. I... okay. No, here's the real answer. We just need to kill her. Okay, what is this one? Each turn poison is self, curse of poison. Uh, she's back to full health. At least I've got the regen to kind of keep myself alive. Maybe I can just outscale it, but... Like, I need to kill this sucker and... Or we just die. I go 
back to menu. Can I can I try that one again? The problem is it's a build that doesn't doesn't go aggro very fast in a good way. Or in a bad way, and I'm going into it very wounded, so I can't take a whole lot of hits. So the problem is I need to kill her because she gives me curses, but I need to kill him because if I don't, he is going to just smoke me. Okay, how much damage? 8, 14, 18. Could hit him twice. No, I think I want to just take the first and second curse and just eat the damage. Block as much as I can. Okay. Uh, Curse of Poison... Isn't bad, but I'm gonna take more damage from that. We heal. Okay. So that's 22, 26, 26 damage. Now I'm just going to keep giving myself the regen. Uh, let's see. Skip curse, take damage. Okay. I've got the regen going. I think we're good. Not going to be able to do this. Okay, you know what? I'll take this one. And heal for 19. That hurts. This is the one I have to skip. If they get spikes, I die. I'll just hit her. I've got enough region that it's not a problem. Okay, this one I can take again. Okay, just reorganizing. Take that one. It's just gonna go away. Maybe I should have actually just left them in my in inventory. But alas, I don't know. Either way, we're in a slightly better spot than we were previously, but not by much. I think I'm just going to leave this cleaver out of the... out of calculations for a bit. Put this here. Grab a key. Inventory is full. We've got a pair of newts. And we do need the key. Uh, yeah, I think we're fine. Okay. Now these guys get spikes. But I think that's fine. Because I actually clear spikes. Take the damage here or just hit him once. We'll just hit him once. We're good. Let's see. Do I just cleave him very slow? <sighs> Not my favorite. Maybe what we do is we just kind of eat the spikes. A little. Because I do clear spikes per attack. Or per block. Oh, but they they scale their... They're spiking, too. Okay, what is this? 15 damage? That's not so bad. I'll just regen. Kill him on the next round. And then ideally take nothing. No, no spikes from him. We're good. Whew. He is pushing that them spikes though. But if I do that, then we take nothing. Alright. We're golden. 
slowly, and we get some disgusting goop. Wait, no, no, not disgusting goop, we want this. Disgusting goop would be good, we definitely need an energy stone if I can get it. Okay, unlock the door. And what do we get? We get a water. Water is good. It's really good. But I kind of want the hoodie just, just to keep my HP high. We want the money. The only thing I'd maybe get rid of is the magical herb. Yes. Water's more useful. How close am I to a level? One more fight. Rad. Paranutes? Paranutes. Off that. Get as much regen as I can do. Only you can combine mana stones. I get why they don't allow you to. So you keep the same amount. So, but allow me to do something like three ones into a single two. Yeah, that would be nice. I would, I would appreciate that. There we go. Do we quaff that? No, we'll save that for next turn. Ooh, and yeah, they're already swinging for threes. But yeah, let's just let's just get my regen and my damage nice and high. Cause I'm gonna be hurting myself here. And I'd like to be able to heal straight back up to full every time. There we go. Yeah, spikes aren't aren't so bad. Not with this setup. One, two, eat cleaver, fool. Okay, so next order of business is do that. Because this way I can move these up here and I can have this cleaver down here. Or even I can do this. That way this is applying to all of them. We get a water, we get one of these, we get a key, and we get an herb if I had the space. I do not have the space. It's fine, it's fine. Anything here. I'll grab the mug so I can brain a fool. All right, and these, these bozos. Do that. Go hard regen. They're not terribly threatening. We can just kind of do whatever we want. And they're not gonna swing too hard at me. Off that. One more. There we go. Alright, back up to full. Queen Cleaver. Off again. Might as well just do this. Probably should have gone for the second Queen Cleaver, but I'm not entirely sure if I would have gotten the the kill. And yeah, if I just kill one of them each round, we're good. They don't scale that fast. I don't scale that fast either, but at least I scale. Ooh, ooh, ooh. There we go, get rid of that. Uh, I'm gonna actually have a locked door. I'm gonna pop this here. Two mana per turn is conductive. It's also freaking huge. We also have the ruby balls. So how do we want to do this one? Because we've got a ruby that I could jam in here. We could lose the Rito hoodie. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to lose the Rito hoodie. It's nice. Uh, but I would much... You know, 68 HP is probably good enough. And like, I could get rid of the mirror shield, but that's going to be really important against the final boss. And this way I can keep the key. Perfect. Oh. Well, 
That is, alas, not that ha that helpful. Oh yeah, rope is not next to any mana stones. That is a good point. How much money do I have? Gambling! I am down to four gold. I've never seen that event before. I like it, though. All right. And it's you again. Well, here's the thing. I'm in a slightly better spot than I was last time, as I do do a ton of damage. Let's see. Do I want to just go with the Queen Cleaver? Oh, uh, do we have any locked doors on this floor? We do not. So if I have to put a curse here, I can. I'm going to do one boost. And then we're just going to hit her with this one. Yeah, we definitely don't want that curse. And then I get two regen per turn. It's not perfect, and it does not keep this damage off. But she needs to die. And we can regen against the other guys. Finish reorganizing that one. We can just leave. Uh, pop that. Pop this. Get my regen going again. Oh, it does. It does increase my poison each turn. Oh. Oh. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Well, I don't know. You just see, sit here regenerating and blocking until the poison clears itself so I can go into the next fight completely hale and hearty. I hate that option though. Let's not do it. I've got enough regen. Oh, do we get another glove? Nah. I'll be fine. We get fish. We're good. Damn it. I was off by one. Curses are true to their name. They're jerks, yeah. Okay. Block one. Wait. Grab two of these. I'm going to be aiming for him. How much damage do I do? A decent chunk. There we go. Get a little bit more. But I don't think I'm going to take any. Perfect. A little bit more regen. Lock up. Not that it really matters. Because, yeah, we no longer have the Rito hoodie, so we can't do anything in that regard. And we're good. Every time I see the Bramble, I'm always impressed with the weird pixel density on it. I, like, it feels like it's one of the more high-fidelity items in the game. It's probably not, but a lot of them feel a lot more, like, kind of blocky and shapish, and it almost seems, like, realistic in comparison. There we go. Get items. Uh, there's a speedy leaf. There is a hunt... Uh, one of these flasks. You know what? I'm gonna go for the speedy leaf. Much as I like the flask, we don't have enough inventory space. All right, it's you suckers again. Now if I just hit him with this, we're not gonna do enough damage. But now would I? The answer would be yes. Or not. I'm not actually, I think it might multi-proc the block.
Go for that. And then pop him one. Oh yeah. He's done. This run desperately just needs one mana stone. And of any variety, any kind of energy gain would really turn this this whole business around. There we go, I've got plenty of regen. We're good. Modern philosophy. Sufficiently advanced regen is no different from Wolverine. Wolverine is like one of my favorite Marvel characters. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Do we do we bail on the wizard's rope? It so far hasn't been terribly necessary. Yet, yeah, I'm going to bail on it. The ditch a level one mana stone instead. Yeah, but then I wouldn't have enough space for this. Like I could. I mean, I guess I can do that. But no, it's it's just not gonna fit. Unless, of course, no. No, it's just not gonna fit. It's two reach in per turn. But it's not gonna it's not gonna comfortably fit. I think I'm just gonna ditch it. Please tell me I have enough money now. Alright. Go grab the treasure. And this way I can stack consumables and have space for curses if I need them. But yeah, this way I can go into this fight. I'm not actually gonna drink the water on this one. Eh, maybe I will very slowly. I'll think about it. Let's go with that. Okay, let's do one more. There we go. I'll take some amount of damage, but I don't really care. Alright, so if I do this... Almost kills him. We'll just wait. There we go. Easy peasy. I don't think I need the extra regen. I get plenty of it. And boy, if we can get one more mana at some point, I'd be the happiest camper. Um, yeah, okay, we're gonna sack one of the mana stones. Because we really only need four. Lord, this stream is early. Yeah, it's gonna be really hot. Like, freaking hot in a couple hours. I don't actually know what the temperature is. And it's gonna get uh, even hotter later, so I figured, why not be early? It's 71 out. But it's gonna be up to... What the hell is going on with the temperature today? I'm looking at it and it's like more or less spikes at 87 around like 5. Going up to 80 in about 2 hours. Um, the confusion is... Then it... Like 2 hours later it's back down into the low 70s. I guess sundown really... Makes a difference? I don't know. World is burning. Yeah. I hate to doom and gloom like that, but climate change freaking sucks. Uh, do we wait? Or do we just kind of... Nah. Clear my inventory out. Quaff up, suckers. One, two. Another. I consider getting a swamp cooler. Oh, I know. It's just my office literally does not have enough space for anything.
Okay, that's give, gonna give him some spikes. Oh, he dodges. Oh, I... Uh, I forgot about this guy. I can only hit him once per round. Only get to hit him one more time. I guess blocking does me no good. That poison's rough. Ow. Okay. We need more space. Get a 3x3 three three mana stone. I'm going to put this one down here for the time being. And let's grab the stopwatch. Which actually is really absurd on this run. I was hoping for some energy gain here, but... No luck. Okay. Well, I do have a key, so let's immediately go burn the key. And go in here and hope for another cleaver. That's not a cleaver. Close. Okay, pop that. Here's the question. Not bad. Okay, and we'll just hit him once for nine. Ah. Not quite a kill. Get that. Finish reorganizing. Okay, we are healing. Not much, but now he's dead. Okay, we get some to quaff, a bubble, and one of those. Okay, let's go burn the key first. Hey, thank you, Link Cool, for the raid, and welcome on in. Playing Backpack Hero. Hopefully, maybe you know that. I don't know. Anyway, let's just... Merc a snake. Okay. Burn that. Burn this. Get him. Do we hit him again? Or do we go for the regen? Let's go for the regen and a little bit of damage. Though, very quickly, we're hitting the point where... Uh... We probably... Want to just kind of hit him. There we go. Let's see. Adds one haste to self. I might grab that. I'm definitely grabbing the speedy leaf. Because we have just a couple of items where the extra dexterity is not the worst. Okay, and we also find food. Alright, be gone. Helmet, your consideration, but now it is scrum it is food time. Okay. Do this, probably go for the initial damage boost. I almost feel like a ring of rage would actually work really well here. Oh well. Uh let's see. Go for that. Give me a little bit more. Consume. You consume again? Yeah. This is going to be smacking me around a little bit. Let's just go for that big damage. And he dead. 
Not too injured. We do get the wizard's robe again, but no, I, I think I'm just going to stay well enough away. Dragonfly, another key. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We're going to take the dragonfly with us. The wizard's robe is technically more valuable, but... There we go. Do we get rid of the guarding band? Yes. Jack Cleaver. Adjacent Cleaver above gets used. Okay, move that there. Move that here. Move here. Or, no, this doesn't work. We need to do that, I think. Oh, there's also another warrior spellbook, but not much of a point to it. Unfortunately, the, the Jack Cleaver is not great. It's not terrible, but it's not great. How much money do I still have? 13. That's rough. Let's go here. Don't you need the queen above the Jack to chain? No. So I'm going to go one, um, here to here, here, here. And okay, so here, 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 here. But it's this one. Toss the debuff, not that it really matters. Eat food. Delete that. I don't know, do we eat more food? Regen's good. But yeah, we'll we'll do one more round. And then which one of these does the most amount of damage? I guess that one. Which one of you does the most amount of damage? Not enough to kill. But, well, it's fine. These guys' curses are hardly a problem. Okay, we get some water. Get another one of these. Move that there. Move this here. All right, there we go. All right, what are you? Care to do a trade? Different item, the same rarity. No, thank you. Please have cleavers in store because I kind of need a lot of them. All right, let's sell that. Let's move some things around. Uh Huh. This is chaotic. And we are actually very much looking at the point where I might want to get rid of the warrior's book. Oh, it does. You're right. Except for, no, we, we want it to be here. Maybe. I don't actually know if it procs multiple times if I do this. But we want this ruby to be in the center of them, at the very least. Unless we get a Cle King Cleaver, at which point that's better. Um... And then we also want to do that. Because because we've got this stopwatch. Yeah. I think, I think we actually... Might not want the warrior spellbook for much at all at this point. Uh, so I'm going to sell this other mana stone here. We just want to keep this. This loop here. Because that's the way I'm going to stay alive. And at some point I might have to rethink this entire everything. Okay, good. I was afraid that there would be another cleaver in this store and I wouldn't... Wouldn't be able to afford it, but we're good. This is a weird cleaver run. 
There we go. What? Wow. Uh, okay. Sure. And then... Yeah, it's not bad. I can just pop this guy in the face. Do we do more? No. So we'll take 19, but I'll heal most of that back up. And then we delete it from existence. I mean, at least we've got it. It's not an amazing thing, to be honest. And we'll have to consider moving the ruby, too. But yeah, uh, no, that, that ruby is in such a good spot. I think what it boils down to is after a certain point, I think I'm just going to have to forsake the... Um, Forsake my mana setup. Maybe. Okay, weapon. Add a rage. Add one rage. Well, considering that's the one I seem to use the most. I don't know if energy you say. Lies, I say. I could have been regenerating this entire time, couldn't I? Oh well. Uh, let's see. Lock once. Go with that. There we go. Level up. I, I don't know where to put anything man. I think we just need three spaces somewhere. I'll just put it there for now. Huh. Because one other, one other option is Move that there. Move this here. Get rid of the right, right gauntlet. Grab a key. Okay. I think that's worth it. Need a bit more energy. I still got the regen. Not that it matters too much. Can we wait? It, you're right. It is my second key. That we potentially don't even need. It makes funny noises. I like the rage. Uh, let's see. Wizard cat, but no. Thread, but no. Yeah, wizard cap hurting my energy. Ener yeah. If I had the Ring of Doom, this would work. But I don't have the Ring of Doom. Uh, let's see. Creates any item? Sure. Cleansing Bomb. Should be good. Another Blacksmith. We're going to add Haste to the shield. Because if, if it turns out that I'm going to get pummeled here... Grab that. It gets me some disgusting food. Finish reorganizing. I'll take it. I'll take some damage. But that's not really a problem for me. Okay, he's going to be the one cursing me. He's the one that needs to die. Alright, cool. That works out. Ow, fire. 
Luckily, we're fine. Uh, let's see. Get a cave fish. Yeah, so let's get rid of these keys, because it turns out we don't need them. We're just going to grab all the disgusting food we can. Please be another blacksmith. No. I'll live. Okay, we've got one more fight. Good opportunity to heal. He's a jerk, but not a huge one. So I'll have enough regen. Delete the queen and block once. Might as well just kind of stay breezy for a second. Oh, interesting. He just doesn't have his status effects. W weird? I'm confused as to why. Do we just kill him? Yes, we do. Like, I like the idea of the whetstone. That's some major scaling, but I, I still just don't think it's worth it. Because it would, it would boost all of these, and it would be better than the warrior's spellbook by a fair margin. But... That's a lot of energy that I'd also get vaguely the same effect by using the stopwatch. I think it's a little better, but it, it does no damage, and so that's the issue. If it was the uh, the golden one, I think I'd be super down for it, but it's not. All right, well, let's go. Candle takes away spikes and regen, right? Yes. Which means hopefully the final boss here won't be so bad. Because, yeah, he used to be easier, and then he got a lot harder. Oh, wait, no, it's this guy this time. All right. It's fine. A regen for you. That's for me. Buckaroonie. There we go. Go for that. There we go. I guess I'll just hit him with that. Right. He's gonna hit me for 22, which is a little... That's a little spiced. But that's okay. Hit him. The only immediate problem is that's a lot of fire. But I do a ton of damage. So I think we're good. There we go. Get items. What does he got for me? Fluffy cotton. Can only use a wand once per round. Extra damage for consumables and I could almost go dumbbell. You know what? Throw everything out the window. Cuz 
because we've got these. Uh, let's see. Okay, put that there. Stupid barbell is too heavy. And unfortunately, that's adjacent items only. Splint doesn't work. And we now have no healing, no mana, no nothing, but we do do double damage uh, and scale. So we'll just find out what happens. Uh, continue in endless mode until I die. So the one problem is this does mean I am pretty much hard locked to Queen Cleavers and nothing more. I have like no way of... We really desperately need some energy generation here. Well, here, I'm just going to put that there for the time being. There we go. Go this direction. That's unfortunate. Delete the B, get items, swap those out. We also have some disgusting food. Oh, but that's not really helpful in the moment. Just choosing. Do we have a store? We do, but it's hard to reach. All right, there goes one. And there goes two. And we get another cleaver. Yeah, so at this point, we desperately need just more queen cleavers and energy generation if I can. Uh, let's finally sell that. Do I sell the mirror shield? Yeah, I ain't gonna be blocking shit today. This, this run has transcended blocking. We buy that, it's six. Nah, I'll live. Oh, here's the other thing. We have that I can get rid of. Oops. There we go. Okay. Well, it's kind of a funny idea. On a functional level, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to be able to sustain this for particularly long. But it's kind of enjoyable just like chucking mad damage left and right for a little bit of a... Just a little bit of a fi final victory lap. Why not put the ruby inside the queens? Can't do it. I am not allowed to. Dumbbell... Dumbbell is stupid, but we're making it work. Okay, next one. Anything here? Anything useful here? Nope. Uh, let's try loot. What do you have? A key. I don't actually know if I need keys. Yeah, so we could definitely use the vampire gem if I can. Holy shit, they have so much HP. Uh, let's see. Yeah, this still has two uses left. And yeah, alas, the splint does not work on diagonals. So this is probably going to be the floor where I get cooked. I will take a weapon. It is yet another cleaver. But I might be capped out. Uh, piss. Otherwise we would get rid of Ring of Luck. No. No, I, I just, I don't need it. There we go. And then I might as well pop that so I don't take any damage. Is 
There we go. Anything more? Do we hit it? Nah. It'll gain the regen, but we'll kill it on the next round. Oh, there's the pickaxe, which is kind of fun. Let's hold on to that. I'm gonna grab that. I wanna I wanna do a couple of tests. Can you undisable an item? If if you remove the thing during that round. Yes, you can. Actually, kind of super helpful. Okay, anything else? Yes, so that way I can have a couple of consumables packed in around these things. Oh, oh shoot. That's considered a weapon. So I gotta put that one there. We do also have an emerald. Which is lightly more valuable. Can't be rotated though. Well, we can at least stack those. Unless, of course, I want to grab some water. You know, the water is actually... Oh, I can't take any more anyway. Well, that's fine. Let's see what this shop has. Uh, well, it has another regular cleaver. Let's just sell those for money. Gem included. It's like a little bit of extra damage, but... I'll live without. Uh, let's see, buy a fish? No thank you, I have no interest in fish. I am a dead mouse walking and I know it. But that's kind of the beauty part of it. There's a certain zen in facing your doom. Okay. And an extra 17 damage. Should do enough damage. It's dead. We're good. And yeah, if I can get just one more energy per round. Or not. Okay, move key here. Move this here. All weapons are anchored for two combats. What? Game plus five damage. We are still going. We are still in the running. Fancy cleaver? No. Tooth necklace? Kind of? Like, obviously the ninja costume would be really good. Only immediate problem is I do not have enough inventory space for it at the moment. But I might be able to. I don't think this really changes much. It gives me a little bit more space. It rages more damage, but requires me to get kills, which is not that helpful. Uh, okay, so... I'll I'd like to do the ninja costume, but it's just not going to fit the moment. And I do have the key if I want to go to Poison Land, but I really don't. Poison Land sucks. It's full of curses. It's not even... It, like, the swamps aren't even that poisonous. Though they do have some poisoned enemies, but that's not what I'm afraid of. Here's what I, where I'm gonna start getting murked, though. And there's really not much I can do about it. These enemies just have too much HP and I don't scale the damage. It's fine. Honestly, good run for having no defense and all aggro. Uh, it was a good run. But yeah, the, uh... The rage on kill really would not have helped there. I would have maybe gotten enough rage for one shot at the very, very end. And that's it. 